morning everybody and welcome back to my channel my name is Laura and this is day three of our Hokkaido trip we are currently uh, in Furano <laughs> still in Furano it's very big and we are going to visit today the uh, glass forest it's a very famous place where they make lots of types of glass and have a uh, Lots of beautiful things to see so we're going to check that out first and then later today we are heading towards a very cute animal farm and also to the blue pond of Vie. so uh, let's just go and explore all the things that Furano has to offer so the glass forest in Furano is actually a place that was recommended to us by many people so that's why we decided to visit uh, they have a lot of glass art this is for example a light up bulb here we have some decoration pieces all made from glass very beautiful if you ask me and they also have these little cute things i don't know what they're called but i love the colors i love the little details and my favorite is the correct glass they had like uh, vases as well as glasses and mugs so there was a lot of choice will glow in the dark you know the gleaming glass so you actually put it behind the ear and you can see that it's actually glowing in the dark right it's so cool <laughs> Now we arrive at Giodan Farm restaurant. Yay! It's lunch time, right? Yes, finally get to eat. <laughs> Go inside. These past two days we've been eating so much meat, but okay. This is their BA Wagyu healthy steak. Uh, this is part of the back of the um, beef and yeah as you can see it's very beautiful meat it has like marble inside i asked them to bake it well because i don't really like red meat like this um i got the 180 size because that's only one day half at the moment then lean he got the uh let's see uh this one this is uh, a special offer that they have going on right now you can try ba wagyu and Tsitose wagyu and you can like compare the two you know and there's like sauce and vegetables and also with bread and here on the menu they have like also some salads some soup um, this is the bread that we're going to get looks very good they use um mil milk bread and um you know, rye and then they have some Roast beef, kids menu, hamburger. Yeah, they have lots of things to try. Just got our food. This is my healthy steak. So it's the back of the cow. It's well done. And here is the fresh bread from this um, like farm with Jersey butter. And Lin has his uh, special steak plate, yes. right? How does it look? One is from Bia, the mm -hmm. other one is from Chipotle. It looks pretty. Yeah. Are you going to try? Yes. Try it. Later. <laughs> Later, first you take your clothes off. Lin and I thoroughly enjoyed our lunch. It was really great and we even got to see some uh, local wildlife. It was very quiet the restaurant but that made it all the better. How was your steak honey? It's tasty. It's tasty? Yes. yes. He didn't like mine. I asked for a well done steak and my steak was like healthy one. So there's of course not that much fat, right? Yes. <laughs> I enjoyed it though, so it was good. We are now heading towards the barn where all the farm animals are. Um, during the summer, it's very beautiful here. You can like ride horses, feed all kinds of animals and like they're outside, outdoors of course, but it's too cold for them right now. So they are here in the barn. So let's go there. <laughs> are you going to pet them? I don't know. You don't know. <laughs> found a horse that's outside it is so soft it has a thick winter coat it seems very friendly <laughs> my first time to touch a horse here in japan actually <laughs> Bye -bye. going to go eat again <laughs> What is this face, honey? What does that mean? Hello. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay guys we have reached um the one before last stop of the day honey how is it how is it well it's good it's good right it's beautiful from distance yeah but you're you're done like taking a look in five minutes right yeah <laughs> how is this 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 tree group called what's this called seven seven stars hill or something, or something. Yeah. yeah 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 this is one of the very famous views in um Fudan, no in ba actually and um there's many more here but it's almost sunset time so you can't really see a lot anymore uh after this we're heading to the ba blue pond right yeah are you excited for that yeah yeah let's go take a look we have reached the ba blue pond now as you can see the um, pond itself is frozen over and there's snow on top of it but they hold light up events every single day uh, starting around 4 30 4 45 so it's actually still very beautiful and there's also a bit of snow see it's the first snow that we've seen since we arrived in Hokkaido of course there's snow on the ground but it hasn't snowed <laughs> so far what do you think honey very beautiful with a little bit snow. Yeah, right? So very cute. Feels like Christmas. <laughs> or like we're going to watch the Polar Express or something. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. Very nice. We were already in the neighborhood, so we decided to also stop by uh, the Shira... Shiragane waterfall. Um, yeah, you just can stand only on this bridge and watch down. You can't go until down there, but it's still pretty beautiful. This uh, volcano, there's not again. This waterfall uh, shows a lot of the volcanic history of the Tokachi like, mountain range here, because the upper layer is um, like sand and mud, you know, and the down, the bottom layer is like volcanic, like hardened lava or magma, and the water comes from in between there. Very interesting. Very cold too. So if you look up your head, you see a lot of snow accumulating on the bridge. So they actually even have the sign to mind you, your head, snow won't fall down. <laughs> <laughs> if it falls down, what happens? And Phew! Dead. <laughs> Hi everyone, I just finished eating. Uh, dinner again at Furona, Furona, Furo, hmm? Furanoya, so the same place where I had uh, lunch with Lin yesterday. Now, this evening we decided to do something um, a little bit different. So Lin really, really wanted to eat um, like sushi because Hokkaido is famous for sushi, right? Even though we're in the interior of Hokkaido, it's still probably way tastier than back in Osaka. Uh, but the thing is, I even though i do like sushi if it's like a good sushi place they serve like very like special types of fish and i'm not fond of that and ever since yesterday i've been saying oh that curry that soup curry was so good so in this morning uh, or like this afternoon said why don't we just <laughs> eat separately you know for dinner so um he said okay i'll drop you off at furonaya furo fura furanoya and you can go eat curry and in the meantime i'll go eat sushi and i'll come pick you back up <laughs> so that's what we did uh, i just finished eating and he should be here in a couple of minutes it also started snowing a little bit i don't know if you can see it yeah vaguely let me turn around maybe then yeah yeah here yeah. now you can see that it's snowing right <laughs> um anyways i'm just going to wait a little bit and then we're going to head to the hotel to relax a bit more so uh i'm going to finish day three of our hokkaido vlog right here thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it please leave me a like a comment and also consider subscribing because it really, really supports my channel thank you and see you tomorrow for uh day four in hokkaido and vlog number four